Hello, my name is Corey Jones. I'm the President and Chief Creative Officer of Cryptozoic. And today we're going to give you a demo of Food Fight. We're going to teach you how to play the game. And we're going to start off with an unboxing of the product. So I'm going to start off by unwrapping it. It comes with a free plastic uh, wrap. No charge for that. Food Fight is a card game and it was created by me. Uh, game design is by Matt Hyra. Matt Hyra is an incredibly talented game designer. And then the art was all created by Rob Momarts. And Rob Momarts is a, also a very talented artist. And as you can see, uh, the package is absolutely beautiful. And John Vineyard, our graphic designer, actually made that Food Fight logo, which is also beautiful. I'm incredibly proud of what we were able to accomplish. So I'm gonna start off by opening this up. And the first thing you'll see is the rule book. In the manual, we have a little Food Fight story and it talks about uh, what the IP is. And Food Fight is uh, anamorphic food fighting each other in these very funny battlefields. And what has happened is that the food world is in chaos because all of the food mascots, the actual uh, mascots for the different products, have gone crazy and they have decided to go to war. Typically they had uh, breakfast, lunch, or dinner uh, were separated and everyone knew their place, but the mascots have gone insane and now they've recruited all the breakfast, lunch, and dinner troops into armies to try and fight for dominance of the food world. And uh, you'll see in the iOS game on the iPad and iPhone, you'll actually get a look at the map of what the food world looks like. And there's uh, some very funny locations. As an example, uh, one of our mascots, uh, Grilled Jesus, lives in Bethlehem and Cheese. So there are all these very funny locations. And you can get a look at that on the iOS game, so you should, you should go get that too. So it starts off with a little bit of a story. It goes into all of the rules on how to play the game. This is a great overview. This will definitely get you to the place where you can play this product. And the video was a great way also for us to get you up to speed much faster. And on the back, we have our little menu that is the actual credits uh, for the game, very clever. So the next thing we have is a punch out. And this is the Food Fight sign. Why do we have a food fight sign here? Because having a food fight sign would be awesome. And do we need any other reason to do anything? Not really. It's part of our fans first philosophy. You know, our motto at Cryptozoic is fans first, which means everything we do is about making sure the fan is having a good time, that our products are super high quality, but beyond being super high quality, they are uh, clever. And that's where doing something like a little cardboard standy, so when you're playing the game, you can actually have your food fight sign there, uh, making your game space just a little bit cooler. And I'll, I'll, I'll let you in on a little hidden Easter egg on this. On the back is a phone number for service. So it's the Cryptozoic Sign Company with a service number in case your sign breaks. If you call that number, it's actually a working phone number. So the next thing we have in here are the plates. Can't have a food fight without plates. Uh, there are uh, a total of one, two, three, four, five, six sets of plates, all different colors, oranges, yellows, greens, purples, uh, nice thick cardstock, really quality gameplay pieces. So we've got the plates. Next up are the after meal mints. These are the little scoring tokens. They're little mints. Again, nice cardstock on those. You can see one of the great things about Food Fight, one of the things I'm, I'm most proud of is the idea that every single piece of the product has something going on to make the fit and finish feel special and custom and immerse you in the IP. Even a silly IP like anamorphic food fighting each other, we took that thematic and, and pushed it into every place we could. So if you look at the little cardboard tray that sits inside the box where your cards lie, you've got the little knife, the little uh, fork and knife. And if you look along the side of the box, we've put in all the art from the game with all the products that Cryptozoic does, all of these you know, fun little cards in a box products, and there's gonna be a bunch of them because we've absolutely uh, started in on creating original IP, creating really fun game dynamics that sort of live in this space of you know, casual card games, um, that making sure that all of that uh, you know, uh, flavor and IP runs throughout every bit of the production is super, super important, and it's something that makes me incredibly proud. Uh, I, I definitely want to make sure that uh, every time you open up a Cryptozoic pack uh, product that you're having a, a pretty amazing experience, even if it's just looking at all the components and it's not just about playing the game. Uh, on the inside of the box is the Cryptozoic Society Big Game Hunter. 
So uh, one of the things that we're doing also, uh, you're gonna be able to register on the website and it just has an individual digital code. And what you're gonna be able to do is register the product so it unlocks an achievement, because we're gonna have an achievement system on our website for your, uh, your account. And when you unlock the achievement, it actually credits you for having purchased Food Fight as one of the games as a game collector. So you can see the kind of tongue in cheek game collector like a hunter or game collector like someone who has a bunch of board games. I'm going to assume most of the people out there watching this collect board games and not, uh, not hunting. The next step uh, is going to uh, be opening up these cards and taking a quick look at them. So you can see here we have uh, lots of anamorphic food fighters with a uh, big bad bacon as a, a good example. He's got his little quote on there, out of the frying pan, into the line of fire. Uh, so you got your food warriors and there's a full stack of those. Great. Let's open up the next pack. Again, we're just making sure we've got all the cards. Great, more of the Food Warriors. Awesome. We've got the eight dog cards and the battlefield where all of the Food Warriors fight. Places like Bay of Pigs and a Blanket. <laughs> so, all the locations are pretty funny. Fry at Spaghettisburg. So we've got your three different piles of cards. Food fight cards, battlefield cards, and the dog cards. We've got all of our tokens. We've got our little sign, which is super important. These are all the components that make up Food Fight.